We're not going home, no matter what to this job is done. And it's not done yet. There's a lot more to do. Well, the vast majority has been done. But we're going to stay to the very end. Every need is met. President Joe Biden sought to reassure East Palestine, Ohio residents of the federal government's commitment to cleaning up their community following a toxic train derailment last year. Biden traveled to East Palestine more than a year after a Norfolk Southern freight train derailed there in a fiery crash. A state of emergency was declared and residents were evacuated for a controlled burn, which released vinyl chloride, which is used to construct polyvinyl chloride hard plastic resin into the air. Now the people in the community are shouldered with concerns for their health to their property prices. I can already see this derailment won't define you. It just uh, it defines you in a different way. Your courage, your resilience to this community. Biden touted his administration's response to the disaster, including holding Norfolk Southern financially and physically responsible for the cleanup. Let me be clear. While there are acts of God, this was an act of greed. People line the streets, with signs calling out Biden for taking so long to visit. Help us! Plus, there were supporters of former President Donald Trump and activists pressuring the president to call for an immediate ceasefire in Gaza.